In SAP, various data is created and managed within a specific sales area that is used in the relevant business transactions. Just to give you an example, let's talk about customers. For example, when you create a customer master record in SAP, you need to specify the sales area to which this customer should be assigned. And the sales area consists of a sales organization, distribution channel, and division. If you need to manage customer's master data, you will be also asked to which sales area a customer belongs. If you don't select the sales area of a customer, you will not see the customer sales area data. And for example, if a customer registers online in the Sano App Store, a customer will be saved into SAP within a sales area that is configured for a web store. Therefore, you should connect your Sun of App Store to a certain company and sales area you are working with in SAP. You can do this in the Sun Admin table. Well, in this table, you need to enter your Sun of App Store ID. It should be the same as the one in the Sun SQL database. The company code is an organizational unit in SAP and is used to specify the company for your web store. Then you need to enter the sales organization, distribution channel, and division, and their combination is known in SAP as a sales area. Another required field which should be set up for a web store is customer template. This customer template is needed to show product prices and inventory to the not logged in web store visitors. A customer template is a customer record in SAP that is associated with a web store. It can store some predefined data like currency and whether web store visitors should see prices with or without sales tax. If you don't specify the customer template for a web store, the product import task in SANA admin that is used to index products from SAP will fail. If you have multiple SANA web stores, all of them should be configured in this table. Each web store can be linked to a separate company and sales area in SAP.